Hey gang. Good morning. Hope you're enjoying the channel. I'm trying to uh, create, some, create something for you here every day, including working on my piano playing ability. That's what I would say is during quarantine, try to come up with something that you like love that you want to practice and get better at. For me, it's piano, pro tools, video editing, camera stuff, podcasting, and uh, so I'm gonna do my daily vlog, and it's gonna be a lot of fun. So this is my morning routine, practicing See what today brings. All right, this is exciting. Um, I want to thank Panasonic uh, for this. Um, I've already actually cleaned off this box, uh, but I'm gonna also clean off the inside. This just came via FedEx, and it is a camera for the podcast studio. Uh, first of a few, um, we're going to basically be going multi-camera very soon, but I'm excited about this. I want to thank Panasonic. Wow, I'm excited. We're going to go make some Webovision history. You know, I've been doing online broadcasting a long time, but I never had one of these before. All right, so how, how about light-wise? My light right now is, okay, do, uh, is, is actually, is the camera being remote controlled yet? Uh, yeah, I can, well, I can control it remotely right now. If I could just pan it over a little bit. Okay. Is, I'm excited to see the remote control camera. Oh, look at that, it's working. Wow, look at that, that's pretty cool. There you go. Now pan. Tilt up. Tilt up. There you go. See me? There we are. Pretty cool. You're controlling that right now from San Antonio, Texas. It's the future. We're living in the future right now. Thank you, Sebastian. Just saying thank you. Sebastian is in San Antonio, Texas at Nelco Media, and he is controlling this computer right now and we're setting up the new Panasonic camera for Webovision and its triumphant return so we're going to be back uh, very soon with uh, video on the show and we're going to do it right look at this look at the cameras moving look at that looking good now I'll be able to move it once we're set up from here and I'll be controlling it from this joystick and that's going to be very fun I love Panasonic and I've got an incredible, incredible light. I've got some lights by Roto Light. They're my lights of choice. R O T O Light, Panasonic, Roto Light. I'm getting a lot of great help from Nelco Media out of uh, San Antonio, Texas. What up, Phil Nelson? Thank you. Phil Nelson has been here since the early days of WebOvision, and he's still helping me with uh, technical advice and putting this whole thing together, and it's going to look great, man. This really cool new technology. And then once the technology is all set up, then we just get into the, you know, the on camera, the on camera performance, right? Where there's gonna be a lot of more deep knee bending. I'm gonna be bending my knees more. I'm gonna be moving my arms yesterday. We saw the, uh, the hand movement, people liked it. I really liked your comments. Thank you for your comments about the can movement. I could tell that you really loved to see that. And so there's gonna be more of that. I'm gonna, gonna be walking too. I'm gonna be like walking back and forth and stuff. I'm going to be doing a lot of that. I'm going to be walking back and forth, doing all sorts of fun things. So there's so much stuff happening on the channel. It's going to be amazing. I'm going to be walking this way like this. There's a lot cooking here. Just, just listen to the Tom Green podcast on Spotify, on, uh, on uh, Apple Podcasts, on um, 
uh, Google Play, TomGreen.com. Listen to the Tom Green podcast. Soon you're going to be able to watch the Tom Green podcast. It's going to be so cool. I've been hanging out with my friend, uh, major entertainer, Mike H., who's hanging out on FaceTime with me. Mike, what's up? You're doing the dishes right now? Yeah, I'm doing some dishes. I figure you're getting something done. I should get something done too, you know? Yeah, yeah. What, uh, what's going on? I saw you uh, released a new record or something, or you released your record digitally. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, uh, I, I took the jump to Spotify. Yeah. That's and a, Google Play. So how do people find that? Major entertainer Mike H. I'll, I'll send you a link that you can shoot out. Okay, I know, but but, yeah. uh, but I mean right now though, like I mean say it because you, then you're talking to the everyone right now. Yeah, just put Major Entertainer into your Spotify or your Apple or your iTunes or whatever, whatever you're thinking. Major Entertainer. Is That'll that, that's you don't have to put Mike H. Just Major Entertainer. Exactly. It's amazing. Check out. You all know uh, Major Entertainer Mike H. from years of doing WebOvision and one of the earliest guests on the Tom Green Show. What year did you do the Tom Green Show, Mike? What year did you start it? Uh, 1994. 1994 was my first appearance on the Tom Green Show. Wow, 1994, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I, I, well, I'll have to post a clip of that. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, it was great. He had an amazing band called Brandon Walsh. Uh, you guys were a punk rock band. You wore masks and played crazy punk rock music. It was incredible. You've, you've described it pretty well. All right, guys, it's been a good day. Um, we got a lot done. Now I'm gonna make myself a delicious steak, okay? Now, I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm going to try, and that's what matters. All right, so this is basically what you want to do. You want to season it with some salt. I'm using sea salt, okay? See that? Delicious, delicious sea salt. And you just take a little salt, put it on one side, put it on the other side of the steak, like that. Just let that marinate for a little bit in the salt, okay? Now what are we going to do? What do we got here? Voila! We have some petite gold potatoes, an onion, and some garlic, okay? We're gonna slice up these potatoes, just like this, real, like, thick slices, not too, not too thin. I've been, I've been living in quarantine here for almost two months now, or whatever it's been, so. Onions are good to have around, potatoes are good to have around, you don't have to keep them refrigerated. Don't wanna have to go to the hospital during the pandemic, so don't slice off your finger. Okay, you want to take these potatoes and you want to put them in a pot, okay? Just a little pot. Just cover those in water like that, see? All right, so this is a cast iron skillet. It's extremely hot. That's why you get a cast iron skillet. I just got it on the internet. I'm excited about it. I got the steak. It's marinated in the salt while I sliced up the, t the, the onions and the potatoes. The potatoes are boiling. Once they're done boiling, I'm going to throw them in the skillet after the steak's done. We're going to hash brown those up. We're going to throw the onions in. I even got some mushrooms I'm going to throw in as well. I haven't showed you the mushrooms yet. That's a little surprise. We're going to cook that all up together. The steak should cook real fast. That's a real hot pan that's been on there for about five minutes now. And we're just going to let that go. Then when the steak is ready, we're going to take the steak off. We're going to put it back on the cutting board. We're going to let it cool and continue to cook. Uh, it will continue cooking after you take it out of the pan. And then we'll throw the potatoes, we'll throw the onions, we'll throw the garlic, we'll throw it all into the pan together, cook it all up with some butter, and uh, we're pretty much done at that point. So here we go. What you actually want to do, and this is a very hot pan, you want to be very careful, okay? You want to throw a little, little salt on that pan like that, just like that. There you go. And you just let that sit there. Just sit, let that sit there. About two minutes, you probably want to put on a, your, uh, your fan, because there's going to be a lot of smoke here. Oh, there's the nice crust you want. See that? That's the nice crust you want there. Okay, now you take that steak, you take it out, you set it. And now, wait for it, the potatoes. While your steak is continuing to cook, you're now hash browning up these potatoes, caramelizing your onions in the butter, in the olive oil, in the salt, and 
in the juices from the steak, all cooking together and coming together into a nice, delicious pandemic treat. All right, so what you can do now is you can just take a little slice here. Let's just see how we're doing here. How are we looking? Ooh, that's pretty nice. Look at that. That's a rare, a rare steak. I personally might throw it back in for another minute. That's just because that's my style. I'm just going to toss it back in there. I'm going to give the, I'm going to give a taste to this. Oh, that's pretty good though. I would say that. I would say that's pretty much ready, but. Oh wow. Yeah, it doesn't need any more. Transfer our steak to our plate. Okay. Remember, this is very hot, so you want to be real careful here. Just put your potatoes and garlic and mushrooms on there. Well, it was a great day, guys. I had a lot of fun, and uh, thanks for hanging out. We're going to have another great day tomorrow, that's for sure, uh, because this is what we're going to do. So cheers to uh, surviving the pandemic and making the best of a bad thing. Thanks for being here with me, my friends. I'm going to have a delicious glass of, um, what am I drinking here? Uh, menage a trois. <laughs> hmm. That's, doesn't really seem like that's what's going on, does it? Okay. Cheers, everybody. Hmm. Oh, that's good. That's real good. Give this a try here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. That is just perfect. I love watching sunsets with you guys.